there were more of them. My head pounded with a concussion. I'd never fired a gun outside a shooting range, and now I just killed someone. So this is what I've been playing lately. This is Alan Wake, is and Barry. what a perfect game to be playing phone. around Halloween. Um, this is a game that I've it's never really Barry. played before. It's like I played it, played it for a little bit when it came out, but I didn't really get into it. Um, that is when it came out on PC. This game came out originally uh, for the phone. Xbox 360 in 2010. That's right, this game is 13 years old. <laughs> uh, it was published by Microsoft, but it was developed by Remedy. So these are the guys that made Max Payne. In fact, Sam Lake is one of the main writers for this game. And if you don't know who Sam Lake is, uh, I'll just put his picture up. <laughs> He's literally Max Payne. <laughs> uh, so yeah, game obviously again developed by Remedy, who made the Max Payne games. But because it was published by Microsoft, it was exclusive uh, to the Xbox 360 when it launched in 2010. A Windows version followed in, in 2012, and that's what I'm playing. This is not the remastered version. This is basically that 13-year-old version of the game, believe it or not. I know, it looks pretty good, doesn't it? Uh, yeah, so like I said, there was a remastered version of this game that was released for the PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5, uh, Xbox One uh, series, uh, and Windows, uh, and that one came out in 2021. Uh, it also came out on Switch in 2022. I don't know if this game really needed to be remastered. Honestly, this still looks really good to me. And um, from what I've seen, the Switch version Alice? looks terrible. Buddy? I think in some ways the Switch version, they should have just based it off this original Xbox 360 game. This game is like a psychological thriller survival horror well, game. Hello there. Um, the it's surprise. got some gameplay it's aspects Go that maybe look. feel a little bit like, I don't know, Silent okay. Hill. A little less emphasis on the puzzles, although there are some puzzles here and there. I think it plays great with the controller. I think I originally played this with the mouse, keyboard and mouse, and maybe that's partially why I didn't get into it. Yeah, now I'm playing it with an Xbox controller. I'm playing it on my home theater PC with the built-in, it's a Ryzen 5 5600G. I'm playing it with the iGPU, running it at um, 1080p medium, and that is giving that thing a run for its money. It's running at like 45 frames per second. It's playable, but it's not amazing. What you're seeing in this video is my main PC playing the game uh, at 1080p high, and it's running at like 120 frames per second. Um, but yeah, the game... The game plays great with a controller, with an Xbox controller, and it's what it was designed for originally. But you got the left trigger for your flashlight and the right trigger for your gun. Just feels really natural. The flashlight's a big part of this game as the um, enemies are all hurt by the light. Or the light brings them out of the darkness and then you can damage them. The game really feels like a Stephen King novel. In fact, you play a writer kind of has this like in the mouth of madness feel to it if you've ever seen that movie uh, with Sam Neill in it from what I remember anyways in that movie he was a horror writer who was almost like living 
in his own horror story kind of a thing. Um, so yeah, again, it's a it's a psychological horror survival uh, game. Not a not a ton of action in it, but very well story driven. Uh, it's very linear. Uh, it's episodic. It's broken up into episodes. There's six episodes. I think there's some extra DLC ones as well. But yeah, great game for this time of the to the, this for the season, <laughs> for the Halloween season. So that's what I'm playing right now. Um, again, playing it on my home theater PC. Um, but what you're seeing is not running on the home theater PC. This is running, looking better and running better than how I'm actually playing it. But Hey, That's Russia, just how it right? is. All access can be prevented. 